Meet Aisha and Oscar. They are on different paths of life but walking for the same cause. They along with many came out for the 19th annual Sickle Cell Walk hosted by the Sickle Cell Thalassemia Patients Network, also known as SCTPN. Sickle cell is a disease that affects about 100,000 people in the United States and 4.4 million worldwide. Aisha, who is also diagnosed with the disease, says that she is walking for herself and two of her sisters, Fatima and Saida, who passed away. It's a battle. It's a fight every day. I wake up and I thank God for that every day that I am able to wake up with pain or without pain. I still have to live my life and I won't allow sickle cell to take my life away. So I, I walk for my family, I walk for my older sister, my younger sister, my son, and everyone else who has sickle cell, who, who can't be out here to support or to walk. Oscar and his brothers from the Phi Sigma Chi fraternity are walking for their frat brother whose energy they still feel as they stroll. My brother was Nathaniel Dudley, um, also known as Big Brother Faithon. He passed away in uh, spring of 2012, um, and he is the reason why we come out for sickle cell. Um, his personality was a shining star. Um, this is my fifth annual walk here, so I'm very proud to come out every year and support you know, the cause and just represent him as a personality. This year's Grand Marshal was 12-year-old Parker Todd. Little in size but full of passion and life, Parker is the author of The Adventures of the Sickler. He wrote the book with the purpose of giving hope to his peers suffering from sickle cell. His mother, Nicole Johnson, an Emmy Award winning journalist and an advocate for sickle cell, says she couldn't be prouder and that SCTPN was a great support for her when Parker was hospitalized three years ago. Three years ago, we were in the hospital and they sent over a basket and it was just that simple with tea and some toiletries. And I said, wow, because we were in the hospital at that point for like five days. And you know, after five days, you need something. So they sent us a basket just as an introduction. And ever since then, they've been just a phone call away. Because I went to hospitals and I saw other kids suffering with other illnesses. And I wrote it for them to try and get them out the hospital and bring the inner sickler out of them. I'm honored, honestly, and I'm just happy to be here and raise awareness for sickle cell. So coming together at the walk is a really dynamic way of getting the community together and helping you know, others see that you're not by yourself, you're not alone, you're not alone in this, but we can come together as a community and help one another. I walk for sickle cell. I walk for sickle cell. I walk for sickle cell. You can be a part of the cause by logging on to sctpn.net and clicking on Donate Now. For Bronsnet, I'm Veronica Guiti.